as a ball, it just, the shots hit, just drew me on. Muscle Bay has either the first or second most dense population of gray white sharks in the world. For over a decade, Ryan Johnson has been tagging and tracking Mossel Bay's great whites in an attempt to understand their behavior. With only a few weeks before the summer tourist season begins, Ryan wants to find out if sharks are, in fact, still hunting in the area. We're just approaching the kill zone now. So when we go over it, go about another 100 meters, zoom around and we'll do it again. Get as many times over it as possible, see if the sharks are still here, they're still hunting. Yeah. Using a small sealed decoy, Ryan hopes to attract any hunting sharks circling below. What you find when the light is this low is that the penetration of light down into the water gets a lot less. But the seals are still silhouetted. So the sharks can see the seals, but the seals can't see the sharks. It's actually a very weird position to be in because you so want the sharks to hunt and breach it to see that. But at the same time, you're thinking, I want these sharks down that other end of the bay and not to be hunted because we know the holiday makers are coming soon. It's looking very much like a lonely, confused seal, I've got to say. So, so the setup's good. Good news, but it's bad news because that means the sharks are still here and they're still hunting seals. Literally two weeks before this place is going to be full of us. Yeah. The attack by the four meter great white is clear evidence that hungry sharks are still in the bay. Now the question is how close are they venturing to the beaches?